Rustic Crust Pizza presents What's Cooking with Rustic Crust's founder and president, Brad Sterl. Here's Brad. Hello and welcome to What's Cooking. Today is part of our hors d'oeuvre series. We'll have our buffalo chicken pizza appetizer. Great for football parties, any kind of party, getting together with your friends and family. This is what you'll need. Buffalo chicken appetizer ingredients. Rustic crust pizza crust. Roasted chicken. Pull and separate the meat. A half cup pizza sauce and a quarter cup hot sauce mixed together. Blue cheese dressing. Blue cheese crumbles. Chopped celery plus sticks for dipping. Shredded cheddar cheese, three to four ounces. Okay, this is what we'll use today. We're gonna use our ciabatta crust. You can use any one of your favorite rustic crust pizza crust. Today it happens to be we'll use the ciabatta. Uh, what we did is, as you'll see in the recipe, we mixed some hot sauce with a little bit of our regular rustic crust tomato sauce. If you prefer, you could put straight hot sauce. It will get a little spicy, so it depends on uh, who the audience is that'll be eating this. Now, the one I'm going to make today is going to be a little bit mild. I just spread it around, really kind of simple here. And then what you can do is, I did a choice. I actually took a roasted chicken here, picked it apart. And uh, you get two choices. We can do one, uh, you mix a little straight hot sauce right in with it. Again, going for the spicier. Today we're just going to use some roasted chicken. But uh, either way you want to go. So we're really going to spread the chicken around. Trust me, it'll be plenty spicy when we're done. But I like to break the chicken up. I, again, think of people getting a piece of this that they're going to be able to taste a little bit in every bite as they go. We're going to put a little bit of blue cheese, like just, again, the chunky blue cheese on here. Just get sprinkle it around. We're going to serve a little bit more as we go later. A pinch of salt. Salt's always good. A little pinch of pepper. And then we're going to sprinkle a little bit of cheddar cheese. Again, it's not a lot of cheese. These are really just to kind of hold it together, keep some flavor in it. We're really not making it as a pizza, per se, today. It's really going to be that hors d'oeuvre. A little bit of, now this is our hot sauce mix. This is some Franks, a little bit of butter, along with just a little bit of white wine. And you can just spray, spray it on the top here. A little quick spray and it's ready to go in the oven. Right on the oven rack, another 10 minutes, we should be ready. Okay, let's take a look. It should be just about done. Perfect. Again, as you see, it's come out, looks really nice. You can add a little more hot sauce if you want. Again, depends on the crowd you're feeding. Cut it up in some pieces here. Nice and toasty. This one I'm gonna cut some strips here. You can always make it a little smaller if you like. And then what we'll do is we'll uh, arrange it here on a little platter. Pull the slices off here, kind of however you like. A little warm here today. I added a couple dipping sauce. Again, I put some of our hot sauce here. I put a little bit of our uh, blue cheese. That way you can, uh, a lot of people will dip the crust as they go. Add some celery around it here. And then if you want, we actually have some celery where we can put some celery on top. If you like to sprinkle a little celery on top. So it kind of depends on what you want to do. Gives you a little bit of everything. There you go. It's that quick, it's that easy. Ten minutes, it's ready to go. Anybody can do this. Thank you. <laughs>